Hello. Okay. In this video, uh, I'm going to show you an example how to perform a moderation analysis. Uh, we're going to use a, a very simple simulated data set. Uh, so here I already opened it up in SPSS. So you have three variables. Y is the DV, uh, X is the IV, and M is the potential moderator. Okay. And remember, uh, we defined a moderation as equivalent to statistical interaction. Okay, so basically, we need to fit a linear regression model, uh, y regressed on x and m and their interaction. Okay, uh, however, in this data set, we only have variable x and m. We don't have the interaction yet, but we can create that uh, by using the transform option here. So transform compute variable. Uh, I'm going to name the target variable as, uh, say, m by x. And uh, then I'll just uh, put m here. And in this calculator, I use the star, uh, which in, uh, means multiplication. And then I'll select x there. Uh, so this is the formula for defining the new variable m by x. So after that, I just click OK. So SPSS is computing. And uh, if you go back to the uh, data view, you can see a new variable m by x is created here. Uh, after that, we just need to fit a linear regression model. So analyze regression um, linear. And then we put uh, dependent variable y here. We put uh, x in the independent, m in independent, and the interaction term m by x also in the independent uh, box. Click OK. Then we'll see the regression analysis output. If we go to the p-value uh, for m by x, so here is a 0 0.000, uh, which means it's the p-value for the interaction term is very small, uh, which indicates a significant interaction, uh, which is equivalent to saying that there is a moderation effect. Um, and uh, okay, yeah, that's all. Thanks for watching.